That's right, Liz. We're with John Reed. He's the manager of the Home Depot there on uh, Hill Road in Mundy Township. And, John, what did you bring along with you here well, this morning? Well, we have a lot of everything. We have yeah. a lot of tabletop fans. I'm going to start with the, the power tower. That is so wild. This, is a this, thing, this thing right here, I'll use this as a pointer. Can you see it, this we'll, thing right here? We'll get back to that in a minute. But yeah. the power tower, it has three additional speeds. Um, it oscillates. This okay. Yeah. And then one to the left <laughs> of that is our twin fan one. There's two fans on it, three speeds each for the window, which is down here. Oh, all right. And you can do one fan at a time or both. And I noticed, John, all these new fans, they come with clickers like you can't get off the oh, chair. Yeah. You got to have a clicker. You need another clicker. That's just for in our hard house. day. You want to be able to enjoy it and relax. <laughs> you can't go press, eh, you know, on. Well, that's cool. Right. Go ahead. And then you have your oscillating 18-inch fan, which mm -hmm. is for the floor unit. And a perfect one is a 24-inch fan down there for the garage. Which and is this one, the one to the left. This yep, one. Yeah, casters big, on it. Big. Easily to move. All right. A couple of quick questions. Oh, yes, Forgive sir. me for interrupting. This is an air conditioner unit up here. Can the average person put this in themselves? Yes. Yes. Yeah. There's a couple things you need. Um, is you want a mounting bracket, which on the back of it, there's directions. There's a couple screw holes to put it up there. It makes it relatively, you know, simple to place in. It holds it, you yes. know, up, up to so that it won't fall through. Or, Correct. Yeah. Now, what about the side part? You know, because they're never wide enough for my window. Right. Well, the side part comes with a little, it's a vinyl replacement kit, or not a replacement, but a kit. You just expand out. Which is what this thing is, yep. right? And that's if you want. We have these additional. If yeah. you already have some, they're broken at home. You can cut this to size, replace the one that you do have, and they work phenomenal. I can use this on Liz if she gets out of hand, right? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> now, I like this stuff. I didn't even know that you had this. What is this mm -hmm. exactly? It's a, a foam or a coil cleaner. And yeah. in the back of every one of your AC units, sometimes you get dust, grease, dirt. Right. All you do is spray, let it foam, and there's a little bristles on top. You go back over so you don't cut, cut yourself. What's this go for? Uh, about 988. 988. 988. Yeah, you figure you, your air conditioner unit, for those of you who have them, they get most, you get stuff in there. Correct. And then you can just kind of take it with this. Yep. Now, what about this thing? What it's is this? All your AC units that you have on your house, for the ones outside, there's a filter to it. All if right. the filter's bad, you want to clean it because that's your airflow. This cuts to size. You can reuse it, put it, wash it with light detergent, put it back in. All kinds of options right. if it's too hot at your house at Home Depot. Thank you, John. Thank we you appreciate well. you stopping by and bringing all this stuff. Jason?